Well, when I first started using OER, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to admit, I, I was a little unsure of where this was going to go. Uh, it, was, it was definitely foreign to me. Uh, but very quickly, I, I, came and realized, I came to realize that it was very easy to use. Uh, I slowly started to lean away from using uh, textbooks or felt the need for it. Um, personal experience, uh, one night I was studying at Coffee Bean and I forgot the laptop to my charger, which I use. And my, my, I remember my battery was gonna die and eventually it did, my, my laptop died. And at that point I did think like, oh, okay, maybe I, I need a book, maybe I need something printed, but I have my phone. Luckily for OER, it's mobile friendly. <laughs> it definitely helped. I was able to do my homework, I was able to study, I was able to complete everything I needed to do um, that night. So um, as far as printed materials go, I, I feel that I think where we are with technology, you know, it, it's, 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 it's moving so fast and I think OER is just adjusting to it. And so it's, I, I feel the need for printed materials. Uh, I don't really, I see it not, I, I don't see, uh, uh, a great need for it later on. It's just so easy to use, mobile friendly, as I said, um, navigating through the menus, it's very easy. Um, as one of the panelists mentioned, uh, we don't have to flip through so many pages in the textbook to find what we need on a certain topic. Uh, so, yeah, it definitely helps. As a student, I feel that the printed materials sometimes end up just getting lost. And, I mean, after I lose them, what am I gonna do, ask the professor for another one? It's kinda, kinda embarrassing. <laughs> But they're accessible online, so if I do lose them, I know where to go back and get them. So I feel that's very convenient. I just have to add, it's green, so we'll be saving trees. <laughs> <laughs> Something that I wanted to say is that at the beginning, I was printing my textbook from online because I didn't know. It was it was just it was hard for me at the beginning. I didn't I wasn't used to it. I I didn't even realize that I sent into a class like that. So then when I started printing it, it started getting expensive, so I just decided not to print it. Um, and then I realized I can still highlight on the page online, and I can still write notes, I can add my notes to the page. So I don't, I don't need that anymore, I don't need the printed material. What I do now is I highlight and I write notes on um, my, my device, but also as I'm reading, I'm also writing notes on my, on my notebook, because I just like to write. Um, so I like to write it out and whatever is most impactful for me, I just write it out on my notebook, but then I can go back and search for my notes too and search for what I highlighted. So I don't think that there's a big need for uh, printed material. Had you asked me two years ago to do an online open resource, I would have said hell no. Um, I did not like using online. I thought it was just gonna be a distraction for me and it's funny because I was actually talking to my little sister yesterday and she asked me what panel I was speaking on and to tell her a little bit more about it. And so I asked her, I was like, Aviana, do you like using textbooks? And she's like, yeah. She's like, if I go online, Eileen, I'm just gonna watch Netflix. I'm just gonna play games all day. Like, it's just a distraction for me. And I was like, well, you can print out the materials. And she's like, I didn't think about that. So OER is online, but you can also print out the materials. And as much as we want to go green, you can use recycled paper, the back of the paper that you've already used from old classes to just print it out. So you're still saving trees. Um, <laughs> so it's still green friendly. There's so many ways um, this can be beneficial. So going green, being online, like Louisa said, we can just highlight on um, our computer screen. Well, not on our computer screen, but they have programs for that now. So. For people saying that I don't do good online, that I need a textbook, I need something hard copy, you still have that option. So there's really no excuse as to, oh, OER is not for me. So I'm currently taking a course, Women's Studies, and um, a lot of the students, we're barely five weeks in, not barely, we're five weeks in, and um, some of the students are still waiting on their books. You know what I mean? Um, our instructor has actually talked to the, the bookstore saying, you know, we need to get our books. There's students waiting. If we had OERE, these students wouldn't be waiting for their, their course material. It would be readily available to them. So I just had to add that. You know, students won't be having to wait. That's a good point. That's a good point. I want to add one more thing. Think about your children, if you have any. In the future, 
I mean, if we're like, I mean, hopefully I come to middle class one day, one day in my life. Um, I move up the, the social status. But um, I have three kids that I'm gonna have to provide money for them to go to college. So for me, having to save money on books, yay. Like, I want that. Think about your kids when they grow up. The materials that are gonna be available for them, hopefully they're still free. All of this benefits all of us, not only ourselves, but our children and our children's children. So I think that overall, OER is so beneficial. The only thing I'd like to say is I was the only one of uh, the five of us that took an OER math course. And some comments I'd like to make is that I really liked how the professor implemented videos. For the longest time, like uh, reading about uh, math material is in my strong suit. I need to visually see it and see how the formula plays out and stuff like that. So I found that uh, very helpful. And I also found it helpful to, as I was reading, the professor would have examples built into the, the, or the software for me to right away practice on it as I read up on it. So I found it very convenient. Um, I, I don't know too much about the logistics behind OER, but from what I understand, it's only in its preliminary stages. And so it's only gonna get better from here. Uh, we, we've all been successful. I, I think we all got A's in most of our classes that use OER. And that's saying, uh, uh, and I'm not saying that it makes it easier. It's, it's definitely a grind for sure. We still have to work hard at it, okay? <laughs> but um, uh, it, it's only gonna get better. And, and I think that um, if, if you were to integrate it, I mean, if you haven't used it yet, or do you plan on using it, um, as I said earlier, there's so many underlying benefits to them, just the cost. And if it's only going to get better, there's going to be more benefits to it. <laughs>